Welcome to the tutorial videos of Hongfa in C programming system. Open Hongfa in C programming system software through the shortcut icon on a computer desktop. Then maximize its main window. Select File, Load Model File from the main menu bar, or right click on Model in the Project View window, and then select Load Model File. The Model Loading dialog box will pop up. Supported model file formats are listed in the lower right drop-down list. Currently, the software only supports SDL file format. Support for other file formats will be added in the future. Select the folder storing the model file and then open the model file. SDL file can use either binary or text format. By default, the software will try to automatically detect this format. Manually select the binary or text format if the model file can not be loaded correctly. SDL file does not contain information about shared vertices. Shared vertices between triangles are stored multiple times. To save memory space, the software will detect and merge duplicated vertices after loading the model from SDL file. Two vertices are considered to be duplicates if their distance is smaller than a specified minimum distance. The ratio between this minimum distance and the minimum edge length of the model is a vertex merge distance to minimum edge length ratio parameter. After model file is successfully loaded, select View, Fit View from the main menu bar to fit model in the middle of the graphics view window. Then select File, Save Project from the main menu bar to save currently project to file. A project includes everything related to NC path calculation, such as models, stocks, tools, curves, surfaces, and path. The project can be late loaded from file by selecting File, Open Project from the main menu bar. Coordinate editing sets origin and coordinate access for the workpiece. First, enable the cross indicator through the toolbar. The cross indicator is used as a reference tool for adjusting position and orientations of the workpiece. Let's start with course coordinate positioning. Right click on model in the project view window. Select menu, edit coordinate system, origin. To enter coordinate system origin, edit mode. Click on XY view icon in the toolbar. Then click on the fit view icon. Click on Pick with Right Mouse button, button in the dialog box. The origin of the workpiece coordinate system will now follow the movement of the mouse cursor. Rotate the view to the top of the model by dragging left mouse button. Move the origin of the workpiece coordinate system to the top center of the model using the mouse. Then click the right mouse button to set. Click on OK button to exit. Similarly, right click on model in the project view window. Select Menu Edit Coordinate System. Access to enter coordinate system access edit mode. Click on pick with right mouse button button in the dialog box. Rotate the view to the button of the model by left mouse button dragging. Move the mouse cursor to lead X axis through the bottom center of the model. Then click the right mouse button to set. Set Y or Z axis similarly and then click on the OK button to exit. Click on XY view icon in the toolbar. Then click on the Fit View icon. Now let's perform fine coordinate positioning. Right click on the main model name in the Project View window. Then select Properties to access Model Properties dialog box. In this dialog box, you can rotate the models by specifying a world coordinate axis as a rotation axis and setting the rotation angle in degrees. Rotate the model until its two ends are aligned on the same world coordinate axis. Use the three views XY, YZ, ZX to facilitate axis selection and the rotation angle fine tuning. Click on XY view icon in toolbar, then click on the fit view icon.
Move the model to the desired location by entering translation components in X, Y, Z directions and clicking on the Apply Translation button. You can also interactively move the models using Shift and the right mouse button dragging, or interactively rotate the models use Control and the right mouse button dragging. The information about models is shown in the upper right text box. You can also center the model by selecting and copying the center position from the information text box, and then pasting them into the translation component edit boxes and reversing their size. Click on the exit button to save the coordinate system changes and exit model properties dialog box. Click on XY view icon in the toolbar, then click on the fit view icon, save the project. Thank you for watching this tutorial video.